Hi, I'm Darren Stratton from Strength and Conditioning Education. Just going to run through how to loosen up your ankles today. You will need a resistance band. Just a loop band works easiest. You can use anything and just tie it in a knot if you want, but I prefer to use these. Really simple setup. I'm sure you've done it before, but if not, just going to take the end of the band. You're gonna, you need something to attach it and loop it to, so we're just going to fix it round here. Just loop it through itself and then tighten it up. And we're going to work on the band that's going to pull our ankle into a better position and sometimes a worse position so our muscles can kind of wake up and fight against it um, so we can get a little bit more mobility around our ankle joint. Always a useful thing, especially for anybody that runs, any sport where you have to move and run quickly, it's a big help. Right, so first thing you're going to do is you're going to loop the bands over your foot, get it as low down on your ankle as you can, right onto the edge of the top of your foot, and then we're going to step out to get some tension on the band. And the key concept here is to try to keep your ankle pushed out to the side, away towards your pinky toe. Don't let it collapse in and just keep your heel flat on the floor. Don't let it rise up as you drive your knee forward. They're the only two important points. Everything else doesn't really matter. Don't care what this leg does, doesn't matter. It's all about the one at the front, okay? So we start off going forwards, drive that knee forward and out towards the pinky toe. We're gonna do five. Then we're gonna turn to the side and we're gonna work our way around the four points of the compass. If you need more tension on the band, then take a step out and get more tension on the band. Easy. Okay. We're going to do five this way. Keeping that heel down. And then five this way. Now when we do it this way, the band is pulling my ankle into a rubbish position. So it wants to cave in. So I'm having to use my muscles now to activate, to keep it in a strong place pushing outwards so that's a really effective one they're all good in their own right but never miss that one out okay driving forward keeping the heel down nice and simple but more effective than just driving your knee forward on its own do it before you train it's more effective if you do your mobility drill and then use it than if you just do it at the end of a session and do nothing